Hello. Hello again. Finally dropping in for another video log. I have just a few things to talk about today. First being that uh, I appreciate all the input I've been getting and the negative input as well. Been getting a lot of negative input as usual. That's fine with me. I get a lot of you're gay and you're a faggot, stuff like that, and that I should go die in there, done that, don't want to do that again. But really I just wanted to ask, do I really look like someone who's incredibly concerned with your opinion? Really? I'm not. Really not. Uh, I think it got summed up really well at work, actually, because somebody wrote in the dust, Hedge TV is gay, right? I thought that really summed it up because it was written in the dust, you know, and that's what this is. Your opinions is just written in the dust. I don't care, really. The funny part is that the same people will smile. Hey, man, how's it going? When they see me, that's loathsome you're loathsome so if you're gonna be that loathsome what makes you think that I really care that you don't like me All right it's water under the bridge as they say where they have bridges but um, on the flip side of that same coin is I was looking at my records right and saw that in September of 2007 I had 37 subscribers. That's pretty cool because I just looked this morning and I have something like 935. Looking at like 900 more subscribers. Now that's really cool. I appreciate it guys. It's uh, interesting. Of course some of my subscribers, believe it or not, are the ones that hate me but that's fine too. But pretty cool 900 that's almost a thousand I'd like to see myself get a thousand subscribers I don't know why but it'd be pretty cool uh, next thing I keep looking over at this picture it's crazy I get a lot of you look like Michael J Fox comments that's neither good or bad for those comments and here is a cover of People magazine with Michael J Fox on it right and I gotta say that I agree, I really do look like Michael J. Fox, although not right now. But when you see me without the glasses, for example, right? See, imagine him with blue lips. See, I look like him, see, look. No, really. That's creepy. So, Mike, if you're out there, who are you, man? Where'd you come from? Am I gonna get Parkinson's? So many questions. I think it's eerie that two people that have absolutely no connection at all can look that much alike. He looks like he's a little bit heavier than me. But other than that, his hair even parts on the same side. Creepy. Okay, moving on. Less creepy, more cool. But on to the cool part, which is what I'm trying to get at if you guys have quit interrupting. The cool part is I took my recycling in today. I had a ton of cardboard and plastic. The reason I had a ton is because I'd gone two weeks, right? Every week I go up there to dump the recycling and open those bins and stuff just falls out on top of me. It's packed, right? And I was thinking, dang, when am I going to be able to drop this stuff off? But I thought about it like Little Jefferson City, Missouri, right? The recycling bins, packed full every week. That's great. What that means is, this little... I don't want to say any mean words about the people here because they're recycling. Like crazy. Right? Tons of cardboard and plastic going in the recycling bins instead of in a landfill. I get discouraged at work because I got a garbage can right beside an aluminum recycling bin and people constantly just throw in their cans in the trash. You know what I mean? It's like no extra effort to just move your hand over and drop it in the bin, but they still throw it in the trash. 
the people I work directly with, plump, drop aluminum cans in the garbage all the time. I had uh, one person, I'm not going to name any names, one person told me, if I don't get money for it, I ain't going to do it. Now that's what I'm up against. That's the discouraging part, guys. That's discouraging. It discourages me like this. Right? Make me want to be like, what? You do get paid. It's your planet, your home world. Where are you going to go? Right? Very short-sighted. Short. But, uh, where was I? Recycling. Batteries. We got battery recycling. People load that thing up. It looks like a big bong. And it's full of batteries. All the time. People constantly putting batteries in. That's good, guys. Great job. Aluminum cans. Even easier. You're already in the cafeteria. The bin is right beside the damn garbage can. Okay? So just make a little bit more effort. I mean, the ones that, of you that are really, really loathsome, that just leave it sitting on the table, I understand because you just don't want to take this, the slightest little bit of effort to even pick the damn thing up, right? But if you're going to carry it over there and throw it in the trash can, drop it in the recycling bin. I bet you Michael J. Fox recycles aluminum. Yeah, really, I guess that's it. That's all I set out to discuss. Uh... Keep the comments coming in the input. I'm really, really digging it. Like I said, 900 some subscribers is impressive to me. When I first put my videos on YouTube, I never expected any subscribers, to be honest with you. I don't even know what I was doing. Uh, I just got on and did a bunch of stupid stuff. And here I am today. Uh, I don't know what it really means, to be honest with you. I have other stuff I'm supposed to be doing, and YouTube kind of gets in the way. And I'm not at work. <laughs> That's always good. And, and speaking of work, like I said, I got a lot to do, and I'm starting to ramble like I do when I get in front of the camera. So I'm going to go ahead and go, and I'll talk to you guys later. I'm Michael J. Fox, and why in the world do I gotta look like this guy? And why does my voice sound so weird? Huh? <laughs> hey, check it out. Now he looks like me.